What's going on here? I'll dismount. Oh, he's wearing a red mask. some defiant shit. I know that already. I'm gonna regret that I'm not doing this on Arnalia because I have a feeling if we we're talking about Defias and Matthias. That was all my early quests. <laughs> There's so much. I thought I saw you glance in my direction. It's good you're here. Sleep with one eye open. Uh, it's a top secret mission, Aaron. We've had a break in. <sighs> Security in Stroman sucks. A powerful historical artifact of Stone Keep. That looks like the Defias Brotherhood is to blame. <sighs> we caught one thief, but the other got away. I don't like it, Karen. My gut tells me there's more. I've called in a specialist on the Brotherhood. Meet us in the basement of the Lion's Pride Inn in Goldshire. Goldshire! Ugh. <laughs> right. Meet Matthias in the basement of the Lion's Pride Inn. The last time I was there, I think, what was it? The job's not done yet. This was a very bold move by the Defias Brotherhood. Especially since they've been relatively quiet since the last attack of the Legion. The artifact they stole. I shudder to think what they intend with it. We must move quickly. Hello. What can I do for you? You have to sit there and watch there at the body. That's Oh, cool! This little ropey thing! <laughs> Defy a strike. Wait! <laughs> oh, hold up! Wee! <laughs> okay. That was fun. <laughs> it was unnecessary and fun. Alright. Well, sure, here we come. I pretty, after once I got this mount in Corthia, I lost interest in everything else in Corthia and <laughs> Shadowlands. Going the wrong way! You think I've never been in this city before? Where the hell am I? <laughs> okay, now I got my barracks. <laughs> I kind of have an old city. And I think some someone, I forget who pointed out today or recently that at this time during Shadowlands, it was Corthia. And I was like, already? I don't even want to know what the cat dropped on the floor. Um, I was like, already? It was Corthia already? It seemed like, well, it was 2020. And 2020 did last 10 years, so. Alright. Hi, Goldshire, how you doing? I usually only come here for the fair. But it's okay. I'll have to get the eggs for the Easter thing, which is coming up soon. Um, basement, huh? It's I've been in the basement. <laughs> I know where it is. But... Over Hello. here, champion. Let me know when you're ready to speak to our informant. Matthias, you said this was a private meeting. <laughs> you told me to keep it quiet. You invited all these people here. Like Kurt, Snark. Okay, that's Kurt's back. Um, that Kurt. All right, Matthias. <laughs> Okay, motorcycles. Tell Shaw to single his informant. Look to the shadows. Will I be able to see them? I apologize if this is a bit of a surprise to you. To most, she was last known to have fallen in the dead mines. 
But I'm not quite oh, so God. easy to kill. Oh. Wonderful to see you again, so-called hero. Vanessa. Ah, oh, Vanessa. <laughs> I'm just having some fun, of course. During the Legion's last invasion, Vanessa was a member of a secretive order that aided in the defense of our world. Yeah, yeah, Shadow Since Blade. then, the Defiance yeah, the has been quiet. <laughs> so then, Vanessa, why did your Defias steal the Drake Fire Amulet from Stormwind Keep? The what? If you're going to pin something on me, you have to do better than stringing some random words together. Who I talk to? Who I talk to? I turned it off. Talk to her. Let's talk more action. She's still, um, right away. the bodyguard for Arleia whenever she goes into Legion. <laughs> and every time she appears, she screams, like, something loud. <laughs> it's like, ah, I forgot you're still there. <laughs> All right, Matthias. What needs done? My few interactions with Vanessa told me she isn't interested in the banditry of the old device brotherhood to her. The Brotherhood meant supporting the downtrodden, those that Stormwind had left behind. That I can respect. But most of our Brotherhood continue to engage in thievery from innocent travelers. That's not a revolution. That's highway robbery. Let's see what you did there. <laughs> she insists she tries to stop them. The job's not done yet. When you on to the past. In this, I trust Vanessa's word. I do not believe she knows what the, what the Drake... Oh, the, oh, now you're telling me. Okay, the Drake Fire Amulet is some of the story about it. Nix Nixia was made public, <laughs> but not all. Perhaps even you do not know. You heard a thing or two. I honestly don't need, though, know if Kevin's actually killed Nixia. Um, I will explain everything for both of you. Speak with Shaw under the lion's pride in, in Goldshire, that, that's where I am, to hear about the history of the Drake Fire Amulet. Sleep with one eye open. So it's got the Harley Quinn outfit. So crowded. All, the, all these humans here. All right, I'm assuming, assuming I'm going to see cutscenes. Tell Shaw you are ready to hear about the history of the Drake Fire Amulet. I am. <laughs> Look to the shadows. Yay! A few years after the Third War, Marshal Reginald Windsor suspected there was evil in Stormwind. Where others saw chaos, he saw treachery in the corrupt dealings of the nobles and the rise of the Defias Brotherhood. Through perseverance, he discovered a grand conspiracy leading to the hallowed halls of Stormwind Keep itself. <laughs> His little Andalin. All this head Andalin. That day, he confronted the most powerful noble in Stormwind, Lady Katrana Prestor. With her lies exposed, she burst forth, revealing her true form, Onyxia, daughter of Deathwing. Windsor laid down his life to free Stormwind, shattering Onyxia's hold on the city. After she fled, we discovered the cursed amulet she had used to control and persuade so many. Concerns arose that Elixir's power may still linger within, and so it was locked away and forgotten. Until now. Okay. That's Bolvar that's standing next to Elixir. And, and, and generic child Anduin. Pardon me. I haven't had a problem clicking on them yet. It, it's more just making sure there's not 20 other people in the way of the... Oh, please, don't even get me started with giant daggers <laughs> in this game. I'm like, there, there are daggers that... Like, they're, they're short swords. 
They may even be long swords at this point. Um, I haven't had trouble so far. Words are petty. Yeah, finesse and chill. Oh, we got multiple options. All right. Ask for more information about her. Ask for more information about Shaw. Ask for more information about the device, brother. Let's pretend we don't know you, Vanessa. I'm curious to know if what human rogues get during this quest. Not curious enough to make one. <laughs> but I am curious to know if they get different options. Especially, like, because if this is Arleia, she knows all of this. <laughs> And his besties with Vanessa. <laughs> the game wasn't responding. Was this on Tuesday? God, I gotta, I gotta read this like Vanessa. Okay. Oops. <laughs> awesome. Oh, uh, uh, I don't have any humans that haven't done dead mines. Oh, what? Like you don't remember killing me in the dead mines? Because I would love, I would love to see the alternate that. <laughs> I suppose. What am I to you? But another boss of another evil organization that needs to be put down. I really want to see this on a human rogue that's done. That's done Legion. Um. Never mind my purpose. Never mind my people. I wanted to help them. The Westfall Sentinels who sent you would merely preserve the status quo. Vanessa sighs and the anger drains out of her. It doesn't matter now. I made so many mistakes. I can't say I deserve it. I didn't deserve it. Then the Legion invaded. Everything changed. Ask her about fighting the Legion. I will. Da da da. I've seen men do terrible things to one another. I've seen my people starve. I've see, seen my father killed. I've seen my own... And yeah, I, I did that too. Anyway. <laughs> I've seen my own revolution fall apart at my feet. The torture and pain the Legion sought to bring our, to our world, that was something else entirely. I saw many people die in those days. You can't come back from that the same person. But the, Vanessa turns her head away and stares into the distance. What distance? You're in a basement. Ask her something else. Um, ask her about information about Shaw. Oh, just Shaw? He didn't want to talk to you? Shaw. I want to talk to Kelsa. <laughs> that was today? Yeah, I haven't had any problems yet. Vanessa rolls her eyes. The spy master for the crown has some principle. I'll give him that. The fact that he still hasn't arrested me means he can keep his word, at least. We have an arrangement. I keep the defias on a short leash, and he doesn't go after us. Luckily for him, I'm not that interested in leading my brotherhood to murder and robbery anymore. It's only the bulk of the defias that actually felt the same. If only the bulk of the defias actually felt the same. It's getting harder and harder to keep them from hurting innocent people. Ask about something else. Ask for more information about the Defiance Brotherhood. Vanessa straightened slightly. Defiance Brotherhood are vigilantes fighting for the people of Westfall when no one else will. At least we should be. Many would call us bandits. My father's time, I have to admit it was true. His righteousness turned quickly to vengeance and greed. But that doesn't mean his anger wasn't justified. As long as there is suffering in Westfall, he'll always be defias. I tried to lead them to be a force for revolution and good. Now I fear they are too used to the life of the bandit. Ask about something else. How about we turn in the quest? A window to the past. Mm. We all have our own versions of the past, don't we? I don't care if some dragon lady had a magic amulet. It wasn't complete mind. It wasn't complete mind control. The nobles already hated the common people. The Stonemasons Guild would never have needed to turn to banditry and become the Defiance Brotherhood if not for them. 
Nothing will stand in my way. Okay, chill. Rotten old memories. I will have my revenge someday. Uh, you're telling me one thing and your, your voice acting is telling me another. I'm conflicted. Rotten old memories. Whatever is going on, I don't like it. Last thing we need is this dragon lady's power corrupting everyone again. Whoever did this must have known much about Anixia. Shaw mentioned this. Reginald Windsor? He was the only one to suspect Lady Prester. Well, maybe his friends in the Burning Steps. Burning Steps? You can go to the Burning Steps have more of this information. She must have had allies. Anything that, would, that, anything that points us to, to people close to her would help. Check it out, will you? Speak with Ragged John at Morgan's Vigil. Wow, it has been a long time since I've been there. Morgan's Vigil and Burning Steps. <laughs> that Lisa, has been... We must consider the possibility that there is something going on in your defias that you don't know about. It's true, I haven't been home in a while. It's possible they are... restless. Anixia's power to manipulate still lies in that amulet. Who knows the damage it could cause? A riot? A civil war? I don't know. I don't think a... Trillion seems easily... Raz... shaken up about things. Oh, I get to ask Matthias stuff. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see if I have a problem, too. Um, ask for more information about the Defias Brotherhood. Yes, let's pretend we don't know who they are. So far, no problem. Um, Defias Brotherhood exists for many reasons, but they would not exist without a Nixia. Did you update your add-ons? That was, like, add-ons were giving me hell the past couple of days until they got updated. Maybe that might have interfered. I know especially um, Weak Auras wasn't updated for like about a day or so. The Defias Brotherhood exists for many reasons, but they would not exist without Anixia. The first war, so first, first war, the first war, so stum so storm wind raised to the ground. Edwin Van Cleef led the Stonemasons Guild in rebuilding the city. But when, but when they were to be paid, the House of Nobles refused. It was chaos at the time. We now know how Anixia, as Lady Prester, worked behind the scenes. She convinced the House that, that the Stonemasons' work was poor and that they were being ripped off. Then she went to the stonemasons and convinced them that the house nobles despised them and would never pay them pay their due. Continue. Damn it, Shaw. <laughs> Her magical influence was a subtle thing. No overt mind control. She could not force someone to do something they did not already want to do. Somewhere, somewhere inside. Anixia played both sides against each other so well, a riot erupted in the city throne. A throwing rock struck in the Oh, that's right. Got Queen Tiffin was killed by a rock. <laughs> I'm laughing because it's ridiculous. <sighs> Queen Tiffin <laughs> And took her life, Varian's wife, Anduin's mother. Yeah, yeah, I, I know that. Oof. Maybe a disable? In a world of wars and demons, it was cruelly simple. It was cruelly simple fate. Yeah, I'd say so. Random rock. <laughs> um, King Varian was furious and banished the stonemasons from the city. They fled to Westfall, where Anixia continued to stoke their rage by using her influence to cut off supplies and, tele and teleport and support to the region. 
they became the Defias Brotherhood under Edwin Van Cleef's reign. They turned to banditry and murder to recover the, recover the gold owed to them. Ask Shara how he feels about the Defias Brotherhood. He's got feelings. It is ridiculous. Uh, well, I don't know which is ridiculous. The, the add-on's not working or Queen Tiffin getting killed by a rock. I mean, yeah, is it a freak thing that could happen? Sure, but... Oh, there's someone dressed up as a lumberjack. A test name lumberjack. Aw. Okay. That's what happens in trial style. People bring out their best and start walking around dressed up as lumberjacks. <laughs> <laughs> He's spinning like he knows I'm talking about him, but no, apparently not. He would, he's, or is he showing off for Matthias? Hey! <laughs> Matthias might like lumberjacks, I don't know. <laughs> My biggest thing. Alright, let me move on. What was I say? <laughs> oh, Queen Tiffin, yeah. It's, it's, yeah, it's. In the in the WTF of uh, of plot devices, it, it's up there. <laughs> Along with I, I, though, it doesn't quite beat um, Arthur said his. She seemed like someone who loved to get hit in the face with a snowball. <laughs> Nothing will ever beat that. It's like. <laughs> that that will always be. That, like she didn't have any guards that could that right exactly. <laughs> she got hit by a random. Ro yeah, I mean even if there was a mob outside, if anything, there definitely would have been uh, like guards shielding her. It doesn't make any sense. It's like it's, if... we're talking about a game that has a pseudo sort of like you know there's plagues. There are literal plagues in this game. It's part of the plot. <laughs> She could have been hit with any number of diseases. She could have been poisoned. I mean, it's this. <laughs> yes, weak as fucking plot sauce. Um, but I have, a, I have, but it's just like it's it's easily dismissed. It's, it's still it's still the snowball to the face. You know. Or this comment about Jaina that's like, what? <laughs> On your list of qualities you want in a partner. <laughs> Wouldn't mind getting hit in the face with a snowball? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. They didn't want to have to write another female character because they're not too fond of them. Um, no, I hear you. Uh, it's like plot device. We want to we want to add some like the easiest thing they can do is kill off the mother. I mean that that it's been Disney's device plot for so long. Uh, <laughs> so, so Matthias is going to tell me about them. Um, about how he feels about the Defias Brotherhood. It's easy to sympathize with the plight of the stonemason's guilt. It's easy to overlook the banditry and murders. It's not easy. I was going to say, bias? It's not so easy to overlook the banditry and murders committed by the Defias. Their goals never justified their methods. That does not mean that their goals to see the stonemasons paid to help the people of Westfall should be forgotten. King Henderwood made strides in addressing those issues, but for many it will never be enough. Well, he can't do anything now, can he? <laughs> all we do, all we can do is to keep trying. Forming a working relationship with Vanessa Bankley for herself, that sounds like another step in the right direction. Ask about something else. Um, ask about more information about Vanessa Bankley. <sighs> Got a short one. Oh no, it continues. All right. 
I want to read it all. I'm very bad at, like, skipping by and then waiting for the next time to come in. I'm like, this is a situation of, I only have two two human characters. I'm not making a third one, even if I am so tempted to make a human rogue that goes through Legion just to see what how the dialogue changes for this quest. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. Someone must have done it. So... Yeah, kill off the mother or bad love interest plot. Oh, this this whole game is bad love interest plot. Uh, <laughs> Stop me before I start talking about falling in love with Sunwells again. Um, ah, yes. What is Storm? What is the Stormwind City spymaster doing? Having a chat with one of the most notorious criminal leaders known to man, instead of arresting her on sight. Good question. Vanessa is not an innocent woman. The Fulbros, the dead mines, there is much she should answer for. A Fulbro farm! Aww. The war changes all of us. During the invasion of the Burning Legion, she took up her blades and poisons in defense of Azeroth. I saw her bleed for our world. Yeah, if you're a rogue, you have to actually fight her. <laughs> she comes in and she just starts a fight and they're like, go take care of it it's like, sure, why not <laughs> and then she joins maybe she's just wishful, wishful thinking maybe I'm just going soft maybe because I knew her father mm. shut eyes <laughs> whatever the reason I believe there is good in her she cares deeply for the people of Westfall and she is not her father. Someday she might actually listen to reason. Ask if Shaw knew Edwin Van Cleef. I don't. Do you have the Eastern Kingdoms book, the one that's written by Shaw and with notations from Flynn? <laughs> Shaw's jaw tightens. Yes, I knew him. Ask about something else! <laughs> this is not... <laughs> this is not discouraging the rumors that have existed in game I guess that existed for a while that they knew each other quite well. Mm -hmm. I know what rogues get up to. Okay, sure. We won't talk about that any longer. Um, ask for more information about the Drake Fire Amulet. <laughs> See, now he wants to talk some more. We don't know. We don't know where or how Anixia first acquired her dragon eye. Her dragon's eye. <laughs> I was gonna say, she's a dragon. Um, as the amulet was first called, but while she had it on her person. Her words were like honey to all that heard them, myself included. I remember a sort of fog around her. It never occurred to me to question a single thing she said, regardless of my normally cynical nature. Mind you, our wills were still our own. It was a combination of her cunning and her magic that gave her power. She knew, she knew what you wanted to hear and how to push you in the direction you were already facing. The amulet could not force anyone to do something they didn't already want to do somewhere somewhere inside well that's, that's, that's just an awkward phrase wanted to do something they want to do already do somewhere inside there's a better way to phrase it sorry criticizing the writing now continue look at how much he talks when you're not talking about how well he knew edwin knew him you know in the biblical sense <laughs> as they would say <laughs> when the, the book is too far away or I would read from it because Flynn does write in a notation about uh, about the Defias Brotherhood nothing that gives anything away but it's like I'm sorry where does you you knew him? <laughs> What's up with that? It was I 
the wording's over there. I don't want to misquote it because I, I you know, <laughs> I was hoping to find out more of Thais. <laughs> okay. When Anixia was at the height of her powers, Lady Presto, she placed the dragon's eye directly on Bolvar for dragon. So that was Bolvar, thought so. That seemed to enthrall him even more deeply than the rest of us. But when Windsor arrived in the sh when Windsor arrived in the confrontation, the amulet was shattered. Anixia fled to her lair and locked the door behind her. But the key was within her broken amulet. The dragon's eye was reforged into the Drake Fire Amulet, and it was used to enter her lair, while she, where she was finally defeated. Many whelps handle it. Afterward, <laughs> the Drake Fire Amulet was returned to Stormwind, where it was kept in safekeeping, lest its power linger. Okay, that's it. That's the entire thing. So now I'm going to. The job's not done yet. I know. Bye, everybody. Um, so I'm going somewhere I haven't been in a long time. I'm pretty sure she has a flight point open. I'm not worried about it. Because I played her a lot early on. So she's done the early quest. Wrong zone. But she doesn't have to fly there herself. Hello. Where is it now? There it is. Morgan's Vigil. Yeah, it's definitely not that far. I always forget exactly where it is. Burning Steps is right past Red Ridge. Wow, I have, I have not been there in ages. I don't think the zone's changed since Kata, though. I think everything, everything pretty much is Kata and before. That's, like, except for... No, I think no. I don't think anything else has really been updated since Kat. So supposedly the word is uh, they're going to start tweaking areas. But that would be a total outrage of like, I mean, if they <laughs> people were mad with Kata, apparently, I wasn't. Maybe because I hadn't played the game since, like, vanilla. I played since, like, the, the latter half of Lich King. Um, so when Kata came and just kind of... I mean, I was upset that areas were destroyed. But I kind of, you know... If you... They were all, like... A lot of them were starting areas. And it was like, oh, that sucks. I like that place. Like, Aberdeen. It's Orbidine. I loved Orbidine. Hey, Red Ridge. I've not been here in ages. Why you gotta stop here like this? Thinking about the flight points, I'm like, you know, it's quicker if you just go on a diagonal. You don't have to hit. It's not a bus stop. <laughs> You're not picking up and dropping off passengers. Oh god. What I remember about this area is as a rogue you used to have to uh to build your now lock picking is um it levels as you do, so you don't have but you used to have to train your lock picking. So you had to find a bunch of lock boxes. That they would respawn, but you had to find a place like you had to find lock boxes so you could open them. And Redwich was a spot that had them, but it also had a ton of spiders. And I was at the level where they were hurting me. But I would go there because I'm like, but the lockboxes. I need to learn how to lockpick. I'm like, ore deposit, ore deposits and stuff. <laughs> you don't want that ore. You don't want a mithril deposit. Okay. Oh, okay. It's less crowded here. People would... Come on. Why well, you gotta be on your mouth like that? Ragged John. Hi, Ragged John. You're looking a little ragged. Well, they didn't even bother updating your wardrobe for this. That's just. just, just not good. Is, is more. Is. What's it say? I'm just seeing if these guys are still here. 
been here forever. <laughs> it actually used to be more desolate than this. You got my attention. What you be wanting, big? <laughs> the Drake Parama has been stolen. Did Windsor have any information on it or Anixia? Who do what? <laughs> You're drunk. You're not making any look of sense. Windsor. Reginald Windsor. What else did he know? I mean, well, you could have all said, Hi, how are you doing today? <laughs> you know, start off a little bit more, uh... Oh, see? That's a rogue. She's doing this quest, and I want to be like, Tell me what the dialogue is. It's different. I gotta look that up. I'm sure someone has it. Windsor? Oh, I... No Scottish. No Scottish. Um, Windsor. What a fine fellow. Gone to the dearth now. Took a whole dragon to finally take him down. I heard. Got it all in his head. Some fine noble it was actually a dragon. And then he was right. Windsor was always something special. Yes, he was. Please tell me if you knew anything else about the dragon and her stuff. I am entertained. Her stuff? Well, I don't know nothing about her stuff. I did gather together what I could find of Windsor's old stuff, though. But maybe his family would want it. Or maybe Stormwind would put up a memorial of something. But then I found out his family is all dead. and didn't hear nothing from Stormwind. Merchant came by and said, Old, old Bulvar Four Dragon said it was Old Bulvar Four Dragon who did all the all the work of revealing Anixia. Uh, it's okay. I think Bulvar, you know, he's paid his dues now. <laughs> We're not gonna go pick up poor old, poor old Bulvar. Winter's old belongings will do. Where did you put them? Hey now, I weren't done yet. Firstly, some folks come through and say it was Mr. Four Dragon. Then, Tyrion? I have some news for you about that too. Then somebody comes along and says it was some champion. And I... Oh no, Mr. Four Dragon, that's Bolvar. I forgot it was for dragon for a second. Then someone comes along and says it was some champion I ain't ever heard of. That could be me. Uh, <laughs> and then someone even tried to tell me it was all very rent. Rest his fine soul. That confronted Anixia. Now look here. I don't. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. Because <laughs> those are three stories that went out. I mean, one being obviously you as a player playing through the game, killing a Nixie in the raid. Uh, Bolvar doing the revealing was another one. And and Varian Rin was, I think, another short story or something that he confronted a Nixia. So, yeah, I... I have to say, I, I appreciate the acknowledgement here that there are technically three stories, though I tend to ignore the variant written one. <laughs> Bulvar deserves a lot of good things. He was, he's sitting up in Ice Crown, all crispy. Now he's still crispy, and now he's just like, I want to get to know my daughter, even though I'm crispy. Now looky, now look here. I got nothing against old man Ren. Everyone, old man, to you, old man. Ren and his son seem fine enough too, but I ain't heard a peep about my old pal Windsor. He didn't get an ounce of credit. Now that just ain't right. I have choices. Yes, it's terrible. Now please tell me where you put his stuff. 
enough's enough, John. Just tell me where Windsor stuff is. Skip this conversation. I'm not going to skip the conversation. No, uh, I'm not. <laughs> now, now I'm regretting that. I'm not letting his memory get taken advantage of again. Ragged John tears up. Oh, I feel bad now. I shouldn't have left him with those orcs in the first place. Maybe then he'd never have died trying to go after that dragon. Yeah, I can't be mean to him. I won't let his memory go to waste, John. You won't? Do you promise? Will you? Will you get him one of those fancy memorials and strongmen? Like old man Rinsk? I don't know if we're going to get the one that he's got. <laughs> That takes up, that takes up the whole area that the night elves used to be in. <laughs> He's, we're just not getting a memorial that big. Because he was, he was a hero. I'll see what I could do. Enough is enough, John. Just tell me, okay. I'll see what I can do. But I, I, yeah, I'll just nod and smile. Yeah, sure. I'll get you one as big as yeah. What else is this? That's a nice dog. A warlock. It's a nice mod. Alright. I'll see what I can do. I okay, I trust you. What do you want to get? Windsor's old stuff. Where is it? Oh no! <laughs> he cycles through. Oh okay, we know no it doesn't. Ah, right. Well thing is, Hick, I don't exactly have it on myself at the moment. What do you mean? Karen is definitely more patient. <laughs> so she would sit through this. We'll see here. Windsor spent a lot of time at Black Rock Mountain. I'm going to Black Rock Mountain. And I. That's a long way. Actually, not that long from here. A few weeks ago, I was. Finally, was bringing all his stuff I found back here and was attacked by a giant wolf. Okay, I'm finding a giant wolf. Now, before you say anything, understand here that it was the biggest, giantest wolf I ever did see. Its eyes to the side of my whole body. Its claws were like, like, like something big, real, <laughs> real big, like. Trust me, it ain't no wolf you want to mess with. So I ran. And I might have lost wind of stuff along the way. The wolf grabbed the pack and went back to its den. It's probably long gone, just a chew toy. That's something else. Be good. Drink always seems to be. Drinks all. Drink always seems to be empty. Why is my drink always empty? All right, so I need to find. I'm assuming that's my quest. I need to find that wolf. Watch, get her back. All right, where's the wolf? <laughs> all right. Oh, pfft. okay. There used to be like a little den that held wolves over here. Yeah, I know there's like these wolves are all over here. Level 30. I'm assuming this wolf is not a level 30 anything. Ah! Oh, no. Oh. It's just. Uh. It's too far away. Okay, well the wolf is is at least at level one. <laughs> it'll, it'll respawn. <laughs> Just letting them know in case they're wondering. Is it here? Is there something else I have to do? Because whenever a new thing comes in the game that involves killing a thing, and everybody's killing said thing. Everything is like, oh, okay. 
My great hero heroic moments been cut short by me waiting for a respawn. Continue. Work with it. Ah, Windsor. Watch your back. Looking for something specific? <laughs> Ragged John blinks blurity up at you. So you took down that old warg, did you? Aren't you the biggest, strongest human I've seen since old Windsor? Ragged John sighs. Well, what you doing here? Take what you found to wherever you sent you here in the first place. Return to Shaw in the basement of Lion's Pride Inn. Be okay. hey, good. I'm just gonna take. You got my attention. See? A fun little tour. I remember I used to die over here a lot. <laughs> because there was a huge level jump from here to there. Like, right in that pass. The rite of passage, I think. I guess you went finished through Red Ridge. I was like, oh, hey, I can go in this area. And it wasn't the area you were supposed to go to next. I think you're supposed to go to Darkshire. After you finish the zone. Because Darkshire was pretty high, high too. Compared to, like, what you may have been level 20, 25. Don't know what the original levels of zones are anymore. Also, the squish and everything below BFA is. to level 50, I think. I forget. I forget how it works. Oh, well, in forest. That error just reminded me, like, I hadn't been there in ages, but there was... I can't... But Legion! Like, it was so recently. Legion was not recently. Legion was, uh... Several years ago now. But, uh... There was, in the opening part of Legion, Alliance side only. Um, and unless you knew it was there, you didn't get it. And you couldn't get it later. You had to get it during the first part of Legion, like the whole battle, the whole like race across the thing to, you know, you know, where Varian dies, that whole, that whole thing. Um, and if you backtrack to one place on an altar, you find like an item and you could bring it to someone in the, uh, what's that called again? That's Stonecart Lake here. East Vale Logging Camp. And she gave you a bonnet. It's a trans transmog option now, but I still have... Some characters have the item without turning it in, and other other folks have the turned-in item. But when it was transmog, there was really no point in holding, holding onto it. Alright. Back into the basement. I mean... Shaw, sometimes I wonder if you're like the world's worst spy. <laughs> but anyway. You won't even talk about being kidnapped and impersonated during Legion. That whole thing. Looking for something specific? Look to the shadows. Ragged John is still around, is he? It's been a while since I've spent sent some agents to check on up on him. Is that a quest? <laughs> it may have been. Uh, he's a good man under it all. Now, 
What are these notes? A Clessington? Sleep with one eye open. The new Clessington estate. Look to the shadows. Excellent, Karen. Finally, something we can work with. Count Clessing. Cles Count Clessington is a member of the House of Nobles and a powerful mage. Oh, I received this guy. He has fallen on hard times since Anduin cracked down on corruption in Stormwind. Anduin cracking down on corruption. Yeah, I don't see it. Um, I would not put it past him to have something to do with this. He recently purchased an old manor in Duskwood. Oh! Horse Duskwood. Oh... I will contact my sources and see what other information I can find. You and Vanessa should go to the manor and investigate. Investigate the manor at Raven Hill, of course, Raven Hill and Duskwood. Receive. I get experience at the least. Job's not done yet. Oh goodness! Could it be that there's a corrupt noble causing trouble in Stormwind? What a surprise! The House of Nobles has seen great strides in rooting out corruption since Anduin's reign. I've overseen much of it myself, Vanessa. Well, clearly it wasn't enough. <laughs> oh. No. Nothing new. Sleep with one eye open. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna kill me. Not having a, a human rogue for this. I'll make do. I'll live. I cannot make another character. It would take me forever to to build that up. I um uh, I guess I could take <laughs> What can I do for you? Though I was bemoaning the fact the other day that I do only have one alliance side rogue. And I've got two horde rogue. I don't need four rogues. As much... I mean, if I'm gonna have a rogue, I'm not, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm tempted to make a Torn rogue, but I do not need another horde side rogue. I, the surprise, I don't have a human rogue? All my roguing was on Lar Layer Shoes, my first character. They were based on uh, my D&D characters. So when it came to make time to make a first human, which was Carrot, it was based on a human. Merrick was also. I do not I do not feel like leveling one all the way for just to get extra dialogue. I am sure out there there is a rogue that has that dialogue. That got it. I didn't find out um someone I, I've been chatting with semi regularly on Mastodon. Like the, my one fan not my fan, but um who actually responds to what I post. I, I didn't realize it was a rogue, too. So I was like, oh, that's why you have a vested interest in all my stuff. Uh, it's like, this is always from a rogue point of, point of view. So, um... If she, she, but I don't know if her rogue is human or not. So. Let me post something tomorrow. I'll be like, a human quest. She's like, I did too. I'm like, okay, I need to know exactly. It's just because, like, half the stuff mentioned in here with Vanessa and, like, it's, like, like, but that is, like, shh, shadow blades. I'm like, yeah, I know. Stop. <laughs> that was several expansions ago. Oh, no, I'm Shadow Blade. It's uh, the Uncrowned. It's like, we don't need to do super quiet roguey speak. It's alright. Legion's not invading anymore. It's okay, it's cool. He still has dialogue from, like, from that. Uh, 
when he talks about being in contact with uh, the uncrowned. <laughs> Upstairs. It's been a while since I've been in one of these old houses. The stairs are this way. They're all built the same. Yep. What was my father thinking? This place is a disaster. We'll never turn a profit. Who did I just kill? <laughs> oh, Clessington attendant. Sorry. I probably wasn't supposed to kill them yet. Seems like this. Those are look like rogues. <laughs> Attendants. I mean, I literally Arleo uses that that blade. Anyway, what's up? <laughs> I want to help. What do you know about the Drake Fire Amulet? You know, a nice like, hi, how you doing? Be safe. That's I'm not, not whoops, business. that's what that does. Attendance, I can't stop. attack that target. What are you doing? We answer to your father, not you. Curses. I knew something wasn't right. Let's get out of here, stranger. I, I'm busy. Okay, now I was like, I guess that's what triggers it. <laughs> and everyone is triggering more of them. Now I get what's going on here. I don't know which one's mine anymore. That's a lot of attendants slash assassins. Assassins. Okay, where is where is she? I thought we were gonna talk. Where is she? Oh, she's escorted from the building. Oh, there she is. Okay. This way. Just. Oh, There's so many. The work. <laughs> Champion, I figured you wouldn't want me in your way. Now. Who is this? I am Cecilia Primrose Clessington II, at your service. Now, what has happened with the Drakefire Amulet? What can I do for you? I will have my revenge someday. Oh, here we go. Oh, wait, no. Okay, here we go. My family was once large, was once large and prominent in the House of Nobles. Now, with war after war, it's just me and my father left. And my father is a bit old-fashioned. He won't accept that our household just isn't what it used to be. Yeah, your household's looking a bit, you know, not great. <laughs> that led him to some questionable decisions, <laughs> trying to rest restore, quotes, restore us to power. Then King Anduin cracked down on the house. And well, things have never been... What is this with Anduin cracking down on things? <laughs> and well, things have never been worse for us. I try not to care about all that. I'm just trying to keep a roof over our heads. It doesn't matter to me if it isn't gilded. Tell Cecilia that the drag bar amulet has been stolen. Watch, I should have known. My father just sent me here to get me out of his way. He's been raving about the drag fire amulet and restoring our family's glory for years. I try to reason with him, but he doesn't listen. Sometimes his obsession scares me. If the amulet has been stolen, I'm certain it was his doing. And, and I wager, I wager he, took he took it to Moonbrook, where he's been off doing, doing business. Moonbrook. <sighs> this is going to be a trip into Dead Mines, isn't it? <laughs> Going to Dead Mines. I am ready. You have my deepest apologies, friend. But the behavior of my attendants. Though I suppose they were never mine. They were my father's. Likely sent with me to keep me out of his way while he does something terrible. I hoped it would come to this. I am so sorry. Please let me help you stop him. I will be here. Alright, Vanessa. Mm. 
misdeeds in Moonbrook. Nothing will stand in my way. Moonbrook? What is Count Clessington doing at my home? Can't be anything good. I'll signal Shaw. Vanessa glances at Cecilia. Says, That's Cecilia Clessington. Whoa. Yeah, say that ten times real fast. She might make for a good hostage. Let's bring the rich girl too. <laughs> Meet us there. Meet Vanessa and Shaw in Moonbrook. And in Moonbrook in Westall. We'll receive gold and a little of experience. Right away. Did you just call me a hostage? Wait. Aren't you <laughs> Vanessa Van Cleef? Leader, Leader of the, the Defiance Brotherhood. Brotherhood. At your service. Oh dear. <laughs> we all say that. Oh dear. Okay. Um. Did you just call me a hostage? Alright. Moonbrook, here we go. I mean, is it like a whole, it's like, is it like instants, dead minds? It's trying to find that freaking it. Do you actually have to try to find the entrance? Oh. Deep breaths. One bonus to Cataclysm was they added a second flight point in this area for all the, uh, that the wargans opened up. I, I re it made me so happy, and I remember that to this day that there used to not be a flight master over here. It used to just be here, and that was it. Hey there. And there used to not be a flight path to Moonbrook. You had to basically go from Sentinel Hill. That was always a fun crawl. That was another. That was a nine. Oh, okay. There was. That was another um, fun, if you died in Dead Minds Crawl, you had to do that. If I recall correctly, and you had to find your way into the entrance. That, I remember that being terrible. You, it's still that bad, honestly. Oh, wrong, wrong, more, rather, wrong turns in the tunnels under Moonbird. I mean, they really should update, like, if things are still in Kata. This tree's been spinning there forever. I think the only place I got was, was, uh, Darkshore because of BFA. But even then, you can only change it back to, like, Kata Darkshore, where Malfurion's still, like, standing by a whirlwind. But supposedly they're gonna start, like, I don't know. How are they going to update the zones? If it's just graphically or in any other way. I, But I, I think we've seen... I think Kata by now? Well, maybe take the giant sword out of Silithus or do something with that? I don't know. That could be one thing. Oh, so we're just going to be, like, attacked by rogues. Basically. All using my dagger. Like, damn, I can't go stealth. So she has survivability. I'd be happy if she actually goes up a level doing this. I don't think so, though. I'm out of I'm not. Now I'm just killing stuff because everybody's killing other stuff. Okay, let me actually deal with the quest. We're having another stealthy secret them? meeting. There's with more Fives. of these agents from Clessington skulking about. I had no idea he brought on so many. This isn't right. Where is everyone? Where is my brotherhood? Excuse me, Timnit. <laughs> I have that. Words are petty. Um, why is it so empty? Nothing will stand in my way. A hungry heritage. It's been a while since I've been home. Something isn't right. My people should be here. 
going in. But I won't turn down some backup. I never should have left for so long. Investigate the device high out in the room with Vanessa. Right away. I wish I had Ed the end. I don't think she has the Edwin Van Cleef set. Otherwise, I would love to, like, put that on right now. Because that would be fun. Uh, okay, Matthias. Oh, she's got Cecilia Clusting. Yes. Supply only the finest goods. <laughs> so, what are all these quest names? The, like, <laughs> things human merchants say? <laughs> <laughs> these attendants of my father's attacked the moment we arrived. They are certainly not the kindly servants I had as a child. These are hired killers. Is the way that they dress up like rogues an indication of that? Um, if my father is planning what I think he's planning, we can't let him do this. They will kill everyone in their way. For so, Stormwind. I, I was talking to you. What, what can I do? <laughs> Cecilia winces. It's kill or be killed. Slay 16. Oh, that's what everyone was doing. Slay 16 Clessington attendants and Defias hideout in Moonbrook. Take that. Safe. Matthias, you have a whole dialogue bubble. Stay a while and listen. All right. The job's not done, Vanessa. I've been wanting to tell you. I knew your father. Long, long ago, as children. We were friends, even. I know. He spoke of you. You didn't join his cause, so he hated you. Edwin was always a fierce man. But he wasn't always such an angry man. He could be kind, and often remarkably generous. I hope, in the time that you had with him, that kindness still shone through. Growing up, I always thought if I was just good enough, just strong enough, I could earn that kindness. When he was killed, when you ordered him killed, I lost the chance to ever see that side of him, to prove myself to him. It is never up to a child to earn their parents' kindness. You don't have anything to prove to anyone, Vanessa. I like how the default follower text is, Defias Thief, when it's Vanessa. There's no more activities there. Sleep with one eye open. All right, let's go, Vanessa. Let's do this. Ah, the smell of straw and cow dung. This place brings back a lot of memories. It's probably been a while for you, too. Huh? But then again, have you ever seen this place through the eyes of a defiance? It's too far away. I need to get closer. Oh, I guess I have an effect that automatically sticks and puts on Avatar, because now I'm bigger and glowier. All right, I have to kill a bunch of these, don't I? I so much roguing. I need a target. I need a target. Or is it? Is it something else that's doing that? I don't know. I don't have a target. Have people killing stuff so fast it's gonna take forever. Ah. Oh no, it's something they're throwing at me that's making me big and huge. That's I need a target. I don't have a target. I need a target. Four. I definitely hit more than four. But they're going down so fast. Did Vanessa get a new mom? Get a new uh, appearance? Maybe I just boost her up a little bit. No, 
I'll, I'll know the next time. Uh... I don't have a target. I can't attack that. I need a target. I feel like tossing my blade just to. When my father led the Brotherhood, he followed a path of banditry and vengeance. I led oh, like them in order to overthrow a corrupt government that abandoned us. At least I thought I did. But I followed the same path. I let the people of Westfall down. I need a target. I don't think I have to kill them, though. Alright, don't fall in the hole! Don't fall in the hole! Don't fall in the hole! During the Legion invasion, we fought for something greater. The old king died. And it became hard to carry on old grudges. Anduin offered pardons and reparations for former stonemasons and their families. I lost almost all of my best people that day. Don't fall down. Okay, here we go. <laughs> The ones that remained in the Defias were the rowdy ones, the angry ones, the ones that enjoyed robbing anything in sight. Like I'm following this person like I'm sure they know where they're going, and I'm hoping they do. Ugh, I think we took a wrong turn. I've always hated what a maze this place is. Yeah! <laughs> oh, you're right, 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 right. I'm also angry. I'll never forget my father's death. But in my own attempt at revolution, I hurt the people of Westfall. Like Stormwind did. Like Onyxia did. No reparation is enough. The Stonemasons deserve every coin in every copper of Stormwind City. Classington will lead us there. Duncan! You weren't even a Stonemason! You joined to be a thief! So, you finally show yourself, Bankley. And with a Stormwind dog in tow, see the fire? See how she will make us all lap dogs of Stormwind. We muster in Northside. Join us, and we march on Stormwind. For the Defiance! The Amulet! I should have known. I lost control of the Brotherhood the moment those pardons were offered. Anyone with principle is long gone. It's only the brutes left now. Duncan rat spun these names. I was always the biggest brute of them all. Let's get out of here, Carrot. If any of these fools try to get in our way, let's teach them a lesson about standing in the path of a Van Cleef. Escape them to Fireside. <laughs> You're slow and I want to get out of here. Take this elixir. Let's go. Hey. Now I'm touring the mines. <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to go that way, though. All right. I may also take many wrong turns. No, no, no. I could get. I, I, I know my way out here. Right? What? Do I? Do I? I don't know. Okay, I seem to be going in reverse. Yes. This is exactly the way I want to be going. Well, she gave me an elixir. I guess I'll use the elixir. Directions might be helpful, though, Vanessa. Oh, there we go. That's the right way. As long as I don't fall in that frickin' hole. <laughs> this isn't even 
even part of the like, 16 I have to kill still. Well, that's an attendant. Take it credit for that. Don't fall in the hole, don't fall in, don't fall in. Okay, good. Maybe we're just hanging out in here, honestly, and waiting for respawns. Back to everybody's killing these dudes. I need a target. I don't have a target. It's too far away. I need a target. I don't have a target. Oh, okay. Let's see. I need two more. Show more. I need to get closer. I need a target. Uh. I'm out of range. Yay! I don't have a target. Is that it? Yes. Finally. Oh, really? I swear they changed that animation. It was execute. It was definitely not doing that the other day. <laughs> that big downward cleave with the Brotherhood has turned against me. Clessington and Duncan Ratsman lead them to attack Northshire, and then Stormwind itself. Northshire? They'll, They'll wipe, wipe out, out the new recruits, recruits posted there. there. Oh, yeah, there's such wee babies in their, you know, starter jammies. Yes. For Stormwind. What can I do for you? It feels odd, yet this feels a long time coming. Since fighting the Legion, I felt distant from the Brotherhood. More aid started to trickle into Westfall, and my will never be enough. The spark of revolution dimmed, or maybe I'm just getting older. Still, I once thought of myself as someone who stood up for the people. Stood up for the people. I made mistakes. I hurt them. Who else do they have? I need to do better, not put the defiance before Westfall. To Northshire. Look to the shadows. So we're going to where it all began. Vanessa's care for her people deserves better than a brotherhood of bandits. I am glad to see them part ways. And as a spy master, I'm in no small part relieved. And as spy master. 
Now, North Shire. Peasants can become heroes there. Perhaps your own journey began at that abbey. It did. <laughs> it's also a strong defensible position to attack Stormwind from. Job's not done I'm yet. not done talking to you. <laughs> uh, this has been happening with quests throughout Dragonflight. I think, like, if you take Look too to long... Everyone else, I don't know. I don't know. It's something that's weird with the programming. Um, can we come heroes there too? Perhaps you're. Yes, begin at the Abbey. It's also strong. Blah, 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 blah. Hurry to North Shire. Okay. You cannot let it fall. Um, we've been to North Shire. Sleep with one eye open. Look to the shadows. They don't I really. Not be of much help, but I still wish to accompany you to North Shire and stop my father. Wait! Vanessa, we're with you. We didn't join the Defiance to steal from innocents. If the Brotherhood wants to follow Duncan down the path of banditry for banditry's sake, we don't want any part of it. We've always walked a fine line. Thank you all. Go home to your families. This isn't your fight anymore. We will never let Stormwind abandon and abuse Westfall again. But this is not the way to do it. Thank, Thank you. Who? Well, it's we got been a all long these... time since I've gone by that name. I think that's... Um... I was gonna make a joke about... But we all got... Fancy red bandanas over our face. Wait for me! I can fly! I'm trying to determine whether it's fast as a fly on my own. Yeah, if I take the flight point, I just gotta. It's too late now. We'll just fly there. That takes you to where it all began. That is totally the wrong way. Yeah, we're by Moonbrook. I think I'm gonna take the flight point. Fly into Northern Stranglebourne Vale. <sighs> Good day to you. I guess Goldshire is closer. I guess I did take... Yeah... When was, uh... When was heroic added to war? Was it warlords? Around no. Upper Blackwood Spire was updated during warlords. Um, this. Oh, that was Scarlet Halls, Scarlet Monastery, and Swords. Kata? Dead Mines, yeah. Dead Mines was updated during Kata. Huh. As for Shadow Fang Keep, those two were updated. That's because of the worgen. I forget why they updated dead mines, but it was it's interesting this time. Original dead mines. Well, I mean the Edward Van Cleef version of dead mines no longer exists, but 
I think kill him. <laughs> I'm gonna be even just even more just short of seventy carrot. Uh Now I gotta fly. If I could think of something that would... I guess world quests... Would do it. <laughs> Lots of tree in my face. Okay. And... I know a chair. I have ambient turned way up so you can hear birds and shit. Is that bad, please? God! Hold, Marshal. She's on our side for now. <laughs> you stab him, guys. Oh, Marshal McBride! Hi! How you doing? We fight in the shadows. We must help. Okay. The job's not done yet. Um, I might actually get Bex out. Knock it off. We're not too late, Carrie. Clessington has holed himself up inside the Abbey and is spreading the chaotic influence of the amulet all over Northshire. I don't think most people here know the difference between friend and foe anymore. This man seems to type. Oh, I have a backup planned. Those agents must have a way to get past Pleasanton's barrier. Take them out and look for anything useful. Select four barrier keys of leading attendants. Sleep with one eye open. Okay, Marshal McCry. Aww. Um, Vanessa, can you help out? Greetings. What's their problem? Good to see you again, recruit. Aww. Wish it were in better circumstances. I wonder if, like, Exile Reach gets any of this dialogue. I'm not gonna start a human name. Um... <laughs> <laughs> and use Excel's reach. Whatever this influence is. Calling me recruit after all these years? Alright. Not to mention. Um, whatever this influence is, anybody with half a grudge now thinks it's worth spilling blood over. Not to mention all the defiant bandits and hired thugs. At this rate, more soldiers from Strong will only create more confusion. From what I've seen, you can knock the sense back into most of these people if they keep if they keep fighting you after their eyes have cleared. Do what you must. They have to make their choice. Defend Northshire. That's pretty cool. I like you go back and we saw Clessington use the amulet in Moonbrook. Its pull was like hunger. For chaos and power, my father will use it to spark an insurrection and bring down his political rivals. He's spoken of this plan for years, but I never thought he would actually go through with it. Even if we know he was behind it all, could he use the amulet to make us forget? To make us think he was in the right? He must be stopped. What can I do? Do that, Cecilia. Watch yourself. Ba, 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 ba. What are these? Oh. Ah. Sleep with one eye. What? I don't know if I'm even getting credit for this. They're showing up highlighted, but 
I need to get the most. Oh, it's a percentage thing. Okay. It's one of those percentage dealios. Do I get credit for the kill? Yeah, it was. Execute was definitely not doing that action before. Yeah. Execute was not doing that before Tuesday. Maybe I just didn't notice it. I don't know. Dude, I'm trying not to kill you. Wait, this isn't what I wanted. Come on, wake up, lady. I don't. Okay, there we go. I don't want to hurt you. I don't have to. are here. It's too far away. Oh. Um, now I hurt. Got no potions. I've got nothing to eat. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'll eat some tender wolf meat. I can't eat tender wolf meat. Fine. I can't do any of that. Oh, disappointing. Okay, wait, there's another one over there. I need to heal, and I can't heal. I have no means of healing. Stalwart Commoner. You go, Stalwart Commoner. I need to get closer. Give us
Echo Ridge Mine. Another time to wait for some of this one thing. <sighs> oh, there's a gate up in front of the mine. I wonder if they faced it. It's pretty sure this was a null cave. But you can't go in it now. Ah, okay, one more. I may have still got to do the other stuff. Kingdom is corrupt, yo. Okay. Yeah, I think that's like there's, well, you know, almost every starting area for humans, I think, has every starting area. This whole area has it has two like no mines. I think that's the first one. God, how much more? Oh man, I gotta kill a lot more. I just went over there because one of the bosses, one of the sub bosses, is there. Target. I don't have a target. I need a target. You should just change your mind, lady. Now I have to kill you. Ninety-one. I'll definitely not be doing the orc one tonight, which is fine because I actually I actually want to put her through trial as well. <laughs> anyway, Looks like it might be at least two or more. Oh, kingdom is corrupt. It must burn. Hey! Not everyone! Out of range. Yay! Alright. Please, please. Please let that be enough to go up to. It might just. I think the. Really? I already killed you once. I walked too close to the area, apparently. so angry. <laughs> so cool. 
Grandpa, I remember them here. You get your your first really sad gear over here. King's honor, friend. Oh, hey, there's some transmog stuff I don't have. Get that, that, and that. Cool. Go with honor, friend. Right over here. Pardon me, why? What can I do for you? Sure, stop and sell me shit. Um, oh, leather stuff. There's a lot of stuff I don't have yet. <laughs> okay then. Marvelous. Well met. Okay. Yeah, where was I? Turning in my quest. That's where I was. Yes, I'm gonna actually make 70. This is gonna be awesome. What needs done? Look to the shadows. Give me that experience, Matthias. The job's not done yet. I saw. Wait to take that last talent point for a while. Which is the last talent point I was gonna take? I already took Hurricane. It was. Over here, right. Let me see it might. Yeah. Yes, level 70. Okay. So now I can open this damn chest, of which there's nothing I can wear. But we do have some primal play gloves. That is a huge improvement. Back piece. Um, what's that? Trinket? Cool. Chest piece. I have a bunch of crap in the bank, too, that she made. But let's, let's finish this up. I am ready. I'm no great mage like my father, but I do know a few of his tricks. I saw those signets you got off the enforcers. My father's private chambers were locked by a single magical trinket, which can be broken apart into pieces. Let me put those signets back together into an arcane key that should get us past the barrier. Then I can only hope we can talk some sense into him. Confront Count Plessington inside Northshire Abbey. I will be here. Let's With your do help, this. Friend, I think we can take down that barrier. Slow down, rich girl. You'll get yourself killed. We fight in the shadows. Sleep with one eye open. Be careful. Look to the shadows. Letting her go by herself, that's not good. Yay! I have gear. Hey, wait a minute. King's honor, friend. Does have shields. But I don't have. Light bless you. Looking for something specific? Not really. Have a good one. 
go. Pretty. Father, enough! Is your lust for power really worth all this pain? Cecilia, you've never understood. Onyxia promised our family power. We deserve to rule! I've waited long enough. The kingdom will be mine! Feel the power of Onyxia! No, 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 no. Your will to survive right there, like your human talent. I have been, I have been sitting on my. <laughs> I have the very beginning. Never left that spot. I get to attack him. God damn it, Thais, you're a shit rogue. Like, you should literally be interrupting. Kick. No! I can't attack I that. I cannot way. fall! Onyxia promised more! More! Now <laughs> you're more dead. We don't need a Nixia now. <laughs> oh, so I'm like, who are these little. Oh, Warlock. <laughs> it's Shaw. Matthias. Will to survive. Sure. So it's done. I would have liked to have questioned the man more, but the power was too much for him. He cannot allow the amulet to end up in anyone else's hands. Claim it, Carrot. We shall ensure its safe return to Stormwind together. Recover the Drake Fire Amulet. You know, trust me. All right. Okay. Sleep with one eye open. All right, sure you can. Have I thought I saw you glance in my direction. Wait. Wait. Something isn't right. Uh, no, don't make me fight Matthias again. Vanessa. Vanessa. <gasps> no, just my little sleight of hand, did you? No way I'm leaving something like this for Stormwind. The Drakefire amulet is mine now. 
I don't think so, Van Cleef. Hand it over. The job's not done. What's happening? The control I could give you. You only have to take it. It's Onyxia. Her will lingers over that amulet. Over all of us. Some long dead dragon thinks she can manipulate me? I don't think so. I've had enough of this worthless trinket. Oh, no. Consume all! Take it all! Oh, your power is gone, and your legacy is broken, Snake. I knew abilities. <laughs> To be manipulated by great unknown powers, uh. time and time again. And to overcome them, time and time again. Yeah, that's kind of what we do. <laughs> Dang it. What can I do? Watch yourself. It's Shaw. Matthias Shaw. Let's talk more action. Are we done here? <laughs> I will have my revenge someday. I'm tired, I'm tired. I'm tired of the constant battles. I'm tired of being manipulated, abandoned, and hurt. All of our people are. This person I used to be. Right away. No, I'm still tired. Words are petty. Nothing, Nothing will stand in my way. Simple girl who wanted to follow her father's footsteps and help her home in the same stride. Girl who thought it was all possible. Vanessa says, says I owe you some thanks. You've given me much to think about. I will have my revenge someday. We fight in the shadows. Go with honor, friend. Yep, it's all the it's all the merchant dialogue. Look to the shadows. Oh God. Maybe if I stand in front of him. What needs done? This mission ended up being far more than any of us expected. Carrot, you did very well. I shared to think of what would have happened without you here. Some time back, the king commissioned a set of armor he made. Armor to adorn our greatest heroes. You have proven yourself more than deserving of such honor. Meet me in the Valley of Heroes. Oh, Carrot. Meet Shaw in the Valley of Heroes and Stormwind. The following will be Carrot. Science heritage. The job's not done yet. Your father died right in front of you. Because of us. Yes. But he chose to walk a path of evil. His death was his own doing. And I have no desire to carry on his legacy. A father's legacy. Maybe I too should find my own path. Not my father's. SI-7 could always use a capable agent such as yourself. <laughs> in your dreams, Shaw, in the past, I got caught up in the desire for vengeance. But I always wanted to help the people of Westfall. Perhaps it is time Hope Sardine passed out bowls of soup again. If you don't mind, I think I would like to join you for that.
Marshal McBride goes back to his. Oh, look! I can pick up. Need help? He's giving out the original the quest. I know I already did the quest here, but at some point they reset. That's funny. I guess I don't love level quests turned on. Uh, trivial quests. Yep, there we go. That's your very first quest! By the Who Man. Uh, wrong zone. <laughs> That was fun. Okay, let's let's get our gear. Let's get our mods. Made a wrong turn. There we go. Eh. Click him. Was fun getting to fight a Nixie again. Oh, <laughs> ah. oh, people. They came out for me. Did they really come out for me? Aw. Aw. Who's that? Johan and Gray. Okay. I thought I saw you glance in my direction. <gasps> oh, cool! With your help, we've we've stopped Clessington from bringing chaos and violence to Stormwind. Go here. Approach General Hammond Clay and accept the greatest honor Stormwind can stop. Tell Shaw, Ragged John won a memorial for Windsor. Did he now? <laughs> well, he's right. Against all odds, Marshal Reginald Windsor helped us stop Anixia once again. This time from beyond the grave. I will see that we place something on his grave to honor him. Too often, we fail to recognize the deeds of our heroes until they are gone. We want to change that with you, Garrett. I'm going to go check and see if I can find his damn grave after this. Perhaps. Alright. Ask about something else. I am ready. Sleep with one eye open. People of Stormwind, bear witness today to the deeds of this champion, who has stood valiantly against the many foes that would threaten our fair city. I guess I should walk through under the swords. Cool. Oh, let's do this proper. <laughs> For their courage, we honor our champion as Lion God, defender of Stormwind and all her people. Rise, and light bless you, Lion of Stormwind! Look at the celestial steed taking all my sp <laughs> taking my spotlight. <laughs> it's all ruined now because of Sparkle Horse over here. Okay, but like... I, you know, props for the mog there. Um, <laughs> but Sparkle Horse, thank you. Let me get my reward. <laughs> so rude. What can exactly. I do for you? Um, you have done so much for the city. Thank you, hero. Wear this armor with pride. The fawn will be cast on you. Lion's heritage. Go with honor, friend. I look, I got a bunch of shit. Good, I don't have to click on all this shit. I will play around with... Bye, everybody! Bye! Bye, 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 bye! Matthias! Yo, Matthias! Hey, Matthias! Matthias! 
Are you still doing it over there, Matthias? Matthias. What needs done? Okay, never mind. Look to the shadow. Alright. Um. There walks a hero. Yeah, here you go. Hey, little kid. Alright. 